All right, let's have a quick look at um, my HC prediction. Extension one. The extension one edition. This time I won't be trying to look up the 2021 paper because I know it doesn't exist this time. <laughs> right, year 11, year 12. What's the split? Do we think it's same or different to advance? I think it's a bit more similar than the advance Yeah, what do we think? I think it's more like 40-60. 40-60? What was advance? It was like... 38. Something like that, 3862? 32-68. 32-68. Before I get into year 11, year 12, again, what are the topics that we're looking at, right? Year 11, perms and comies. Per permies and comies. Anything else? What was the ones where we did like the, the, the rate of change? Yeah, related rates. I kept yelling at me for asking questions because I didn't understand. How dare you ask, how dare you ask questions? Yeah, questions are not allowed. But, um, to, to be fair, it was taking me a long time to grasp it. I can understand it. Interaction vectors. Uh, Interaction vectors. Uh, that is technically year 12, actually. I know you probably did it. You might have done term 4. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, trig um, factorizations. Oh, yeah, yeah, trig identities. Yeah, that's a bit of both. It's kind of both in year 11 and year 12. What about, what about the, the polynomial? Yeah, that's it, yeah. Polynomials, yep. Uh, you know, long division is your year four thing. You might have done it. <laughs> okay. I long division in Oh, that would have made polynomial long division a lot harder then. Um, so right now we've got like four year 11 topics, one year 12 topic. Okay, well, when I oh, year 11, we're going to Yeah. Did we get all the 11 ones? No, we didn't. I uh, do break to... Where you're graphing the rates of how things change. Rates of change. So some might call those related rates, hey? Is no, it? No, no, exponential. Differential equations. Exponentials. Like exponential growth and decay? Yeah. Okay, so you did do a modified version of that from the advance. So we can put that in. Modified exponential. Uh, yep. Differential equations. Yeah, that's your 12. Yep. Inverse, inverse, inverse trig, yep. Yeah. yeah, that no, that's different. That's that's further, that falls under further integration. Uh, so along with that is like substitution. Um, yeah, well, yeah, differential equation and further integration are technically different. So further integration, oh, like the trig integration, the sine squared, cos squared stuff. Binomial yeah, good binomial. Was it, was it extension or advance they all mushed together where we did rates of decay? Uh, yeah, so in year 11 you would have done that in both courses. In extension 1 they do extend it a bit. The takeaway from all of this is if you have a look at this, compared to advanced, right, there's actually a lot of standalone topics in year 11. So when you think about the weighting of year 11, no matter what the percentage, this is stuff you might not have done for a while compared to this stuff over here because they're not necessarily assumed knowledge. There are some exceptions, like trig identities you do use in some of the integration and inverse trig stuff. Um, but, you know, for the most part, perms and comms, relative rates, polynomials, modify exponential growth, these are kind of like standalone topics that uh, you guys might need to think about refreshing yourselves on. Right? You want to say something? I was just going to say, was it mathematical induction? Oh, yeah. And again, another standalone topic, right? So induction, that's a good one. So, let's go and have a look at our distribution over here. So, year 11 to year 12. What? 28%. 28 <laughs> And you tried to convince us as well. I dare you. 28%. 72%. Have a look at it. What things have we got going on here? What... Do we suspect some of these might be? The most popular one is 124. 12.4. In year 12, is that what you're looking? Yeah. What do you, what's that one? Hmm. What do we suspect it might be? I feel like it's a lot of trig identities. Trig. Trig, you reckon? So you reckon trig might be this one? Yeah. 12.3 vectors. 12.3 vectors, you reckon? Mm. So interesting in year 12, it's a fairly even split amongst these here, right? 12.1. Three, four. Uh, remember how we said that sometimes there's sometimes that have some of the technology 
Yeah, that's right. So yeah, if the, sometimes they don't come so up at all. Technology related. So these ones, I'm not too sure why. The, oh, that's probably because the last one in each one is generally like a um, problem solving or general like uses arguments and abstract ideas. It's just like a general dot point. It doesn't, it's not specific or anything. Um, so keeping up, Josh. Sorry. sorry. <laughs> yeah. um, so in year 11, though, 11.5 looks like the biggest waiting there. I feel there. like that's firm and common. What's that? I think 11.5 has to be, because like terms and cons will show up, but it'll be every now and then. Remember this paper, by the way, what paper is this? This is the 2020 paper, the one that you're doing right now. And obviously you've only done the multiple choice, but you can have a flick through and you can think, hey, what's coming up? Or what, what is there a lot of, right? So if you want to, and again, so this is the analysis I'm thinking. I'm not saying this is what this year's paper is going to be like. No one really knows, right? But what we're trying to do is get an idea of what it could be like. And think about, put yourselves in the shoes of the students last year. If you had sat this paper, Right, would you be ready for this? Okay, that's how I try and use this information here. Right? Would I be ready for this kind of distribution? Like maybe uh, this coming year, maybe eleven five won't be examined as much. Maybe it will be eleven two. I don't know. Or you think eleven two is permanent? Because we learned it pretty early on. I think it's trig identity. All right, let's have a look. I'll put you out of misery. So, what are we looking for? I'm looking for. 11.5? 5. 11.5 5 just doesn't exist. Okay, 11.1. So that's, remember, your kind of basic algebra stuff. Uh, I think they do use some more advanced techniques. So, you know, like your quadratic inequalities and that kind of thing there. 11.2, let's have a look. Okay, manipulate and graphical functions as well. So, um... That might be, oh, something we didn't mention, the graphing techniques, if you sort of remember that, where you had to oh, graph, yeah, that kind of stuff. We didn't really talk about that. That seems like it could be a big part of that. Um, yeah, square roots, um, reciprocals, that kind of thing. And what's 11? The moment of truth, 11.3 is? Inverse. Oh, it looks like you did do a bit of inverse trig in year 11, apparently. Um, but yeah, trig identities, compound angles. Eleven four. Oh, so interesting, right? Very low testing of this particular topic. And like I said, I'm not saying that this is always going to happen. But I'm just saying, you know, if you didn't know your modified exponential growth that year, then you kind of you kind of got a bit lucky, right? It wasn't very weight, yeah. it wasn't weighted very highly. Um, at the same time, don't focus all your attention on one topic because what if it only comes up 1% of the exam, right? Come on. And Come your favorite. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. All right. 11.5, okay. Legendary. That's what I want to see. And obviously no technology or that thing. <laughs> all right. Okay, 12. Oh, 12. Year 12, year 12. Let's have a look. Yeah. There we go, year 12. Let's have a look. All right, 12.1. So anything involving proofs or calculus. So that probably involves my, that probably might be induction as well. Calculus to model and solve problems. So year 12 calculus. Uh, I think differential equations is a separate dot point. So that might be something else. Let's come back to that actually. I'll double check. What, what did we think that 12.4 was again? What do we think of this? Yeah, what do we think out of these? Vector. Vectors, you reckon? Vectors, yeah. Oh, yeah, probably. Either vectors or integration, you're thinking. Okay, let's have a look. 12. Maybe 12.3 or 12.4 are in the vectors. Let's check 12.2. Oh, there's vectors. Oh. So again, it's a new topic, right? But a surprisingly low amount compared to some of the others. Um, that, that probably caught me off guard because I was probably thinking, hey, all of this new stuff, they probably want to test quite heavily, right? But that doesn't seem the case this year. Mm. 
Okay. Integration. Integration. So, so, so maybe my thought as a kid was always, hey, they'll probably like alternate between, um, <laughs> you're saying, they'll probably alternate between, oh, you know, this year we'll test a lot of vectors, this year we won't test as much. Uh, I don't think that's actually how it works in reality now as a teacher. Um, but yeah, that was just always what I thought as a kid. 12 3. Trig, solving trig equations. 12 4, there's your calculus. So this is more like integration. So differential equations following the solves the revolutions. 12 4, biggest distribution there, 23%. 12 5, stats. We didn't actually put that on the list. That's your. Um, it's kind of like the binomial topic. It's, it's actually a separate topic, though. It's uh, involving, if you remember, you have to use the table sometimes or uh, the pop, what's it called? Population sampling, that kind of stuff. But wasn't that in the binomial topic? Yeah, so by, yeah, it kind of was. It was, it was uh, yeah, yeah, sorry. It was in the same. I separate them because binomial also talks about binomial expansions, which are slightly different. Yeah, that's more like an algebra. Oh, sorry, that is year 11. Yeah. Binomial probability in yeah. year 12, sorry, yeah. Binomial, yeah, so it's actually both, hey. Okay. Um, and what are we missing? 12, six is technology. 12, seven is a general dot point, so just communicating. 12, one, yeah, that's probably induction or, um, I'm trying to think what else that would be. But yeah, so that, that's why I say like, they, it depends which questions they associate this one with, right? Like I said, you can check what they determine as 12, seven. If you look at, um, if you bring up the mathematics extension one 2020, and you bring up this bad boy, if you go to the question, because you can, you can look up what they determine as each question, ME 12, 7. So for example, and so, so this one, this is a perms and commas question, but they also attribute this 12, 7 thing to it, right? Um, so, yeah. Explain the question. Yeah, that's what it looks like. <laughs> because explaining, pro evaluate, it's probably like, explain. it's probably a question like explain or something like that, yeah. So Anyway, that's uh, the... 2020 analysis and our 2021 predictions. Hope that helps and uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time.